Wait, what? I can't, it's too cold. It's too cold. Okay, I bought like... Uh, I bought like six hamburgers, man. We haven't had Burger King in the, like forever. Do this. It's a nice background. I bought six hamburgers. A menu. And um, two new hamburgers because I want to try them. They were called... Um, Nope. Oh yeah, um, two crispy chickens. One uh, of the new crispy chickens, which is called... Yankee crispy chicken. It's called a Yankee. It's, in back it's backwards, but it's called Yankee crispy chicken. And I bought the other one that's also called the Yankee crispy chicken. Oh, sorry, Yankee burger. But that one is uh, beef, and it's not the, the not the chicken variety. And I didn't customize the Coke, so I just got a Coke Zero. I typically wouldn't go out just to go to Burger King, but I went out uh, to buy some uh, vape juice. Uh, here's the Yankee one. I think the Yankee part is... Um, does crispy chicken always have the salad? I think so. I think the Yankee part is just the uh, sauce. You know what this is? It's like a Big Mac sauce. <laughs> it's like a Big Mac sauce. I've never been here. Cheeky. The only place that's really open are like these two um, cafes. Oh, I fucked the camera. And then of course the bingo aisle. Where all the old people go to die. Right there. It's pretty beautiful. I was gonna go sit down in Burking, but it was a bunch of, um, I don't know what they were. If they were like junkies or 
like uh, poorly mannered immigrants, but they were ruining the vibe. It felt like a junkie heaven. It was like eight, nine people just like slurring their words, walking up and down, being like super obnoxious. I think honestly it might be um, yeah I think I like that one more than the original sauce no it's better It's uh, two degrees here in Sweden. I'm gonna put some gloves on. Damn, now my gloves are ice cold. Mm. And I only bought my thin. Gym pants. The plan wasn't really to go to Burger King. It was just to, uh, you know, get the vape supply. You see this fountain here? It's closed off. Typically when we come here, this fountain is always on, yeah? Now it's off. So now you can uh, piss in it, I guess, and fill it up. Down there is the Systembolaget. It's when you buy alcohol, officially, only place. Only real official place to buy alcohol. Uh, go, I like that. Ooh. You know what, the, that outfit is probably the ugliest thing I can ever imagine someone wearing. Not the full outfit, but the pants. It's the, uh, like the, the most, one of the cringiest uh, pants I can imagine. It's the, um, what is the black skin tight thing called? Um, not nylon. Looks like a um, deflatable trash bag. Spandex, maybe. Latex, latex, yeah. Now nah, that shit should be illegal in public. I'll be, I'll be honest. Okay, but the problem with that one is it was latex pants, but it was. Not tight latex pants, it was loose latex pants with the creases and the folds and the oversizedness. But the material was that shiny latex. It's nine, so most things are shutting down. I think Birking is uh, open until forever. All right, I want to try the beef one. 
I think I'm just gonna eat two and then save the other ones for later. This is the uh, Yankee one too. The two I have left are just normal crispy chickens. Just a normal one. They were three dollars each. Uh, this one looks good on the menu, but it is smashed here. Wait. Wait, what? The It was under the cheese. Oh my god, how paper thin is it? It was hiding under cheese. That's a piece of paper. Wow. Jesus. Okay, I was actually shook for like the longest time there, but I guess they did put the beef, but it was just paper thin under the cheese. I mean beef. Did I say beef or cheese? I forgot. I can't even taste any beef. That would have been insane if they actually forgot about it. That was a visual shock to me. I was flabbergasted. That looks like a normal cheeseburger. It's just a Yankee sauce. It's not bad. Well, I did pay a good like extra 80% for this compared to a normal cheeseburger. So not really worth it. This was um, three dollars. A cheeseburger is like um, one point five dollars. That's an eighty percent markup. I like the crispy chicken more actually. Yeah, the crispy chicken was better with the, the sauce. No problem. You know what I wish I got? An apple pie. Although, from looking at the menu, I believe. Um, isn't Burger King's apple pie kind of weird looking? Like it doesn't look like fast food. It's the round pie. That doesn't look very portable, I think. 
when I want a pie, I'm looking for like a McDonald's pie. That's the shape I want. It's like a nice, neatly folded in package. It's very portable. But from looking at the pictures in Burger King, it's like a, it's like a disc shape. And it's like a closed in pie. It's like a, the top is open, so it doesn't look very portable. Well, there's a nightclub open there. It's Tuesday, right? I think so. Oh, yeah. I forgot if people party on Tuesday or Wednesday. I think it's Wednesday. The bingo aisle is closing, I see. That's the bingo aisle. That's where I get, um, that's where I, <coughs> that's where I go to get some strange. Mommy. It's a, a the thing behind me is like a brunch place. Well, it's a brunch place during days, and it's um, like a bar drinking hub at night. I've only been there a few times. I don't like it because it's like it's outside. It's jam-packed, like whenever it's open, it's just jam-packed, it's cancer. Like it's hard to get a place, hard to get a seat. People are screaming and it's very annoying, but it does look good, but it's closed right now. They have like nice, um, like brunch platters, I guess. Where they have like a platter and they have an ananas some seafood, fruits, stuff like that. <sighs> it's very cold. That's the castle where we go and pray every night. Twice, twice on Sunday. This looks like a, you know what it looks like because it's so peaceful and calm. It looks like a prop town. <laughs> you know, like, um, it was a good example. I think I saw this, I saw a series or a movie or something. I forgot what it was. Oh yeah. Yeah, it looks like a prop town. I like uh, from uh, Truman Show. That's what I was thinking of. It looks like there's just NPCs walking around. Just like casually sometimes in the background. The castle is over there, by the way. I don't know if there's many activities there, but I assume not. I don't even know if the castle is lit up. Sometimes it's lit up. There's more light there than usual, but... It mm, looks normal.
It's so cold. I heard an English uh, female voice. Hug me. Do I not uh, do I not look huggable in this? It's like a bear suit. I've had it for like five years, and I also buy, bought it for fifty dollars. It's a very good suit. Mm. All right, two chicken burgers. I'll leave that for later so I don't have to cook food later. This is how it looks like. Th these are two different uh, companies, but they are basically the same thing. This is what I like about uh, my city, is the like ar architecture. Like as I said, everything looks like a... The, the buildings look like prop cities, like they look fake, like a, from the Truman Show, like this. Like the fact that the buildings are so short, it's like two stories and then, you know, sometimes three, I guess. But then the, that's about it, right? I like that. It doesn't feel like you're a little ant in like New York City or something. It's like cozy, you know? Like this is the center and it doesn't have any tall skyscrapers or tall uh, buildings. Skyscrapers might be like push, pushing it. It's sweet, sweet enough after all, but like there's no tall buildings, you know what I mean? Okay, I think a good point of reference is like the tallest building is like the, the church, literally. <laughs> And no one goes to church. No one. Oh, they got some new seedings. Ooh, ooh. I'm sorry, it's so cold. Yeah, you should see how it looks like when it's actually Christmas. Pretty cozy with the lights and all that. Damn, even with these gloves, they're not helping. It's a very simple design, I guess. Nice blockage. Ooh. I'll uh, take a small detour. I can barely speak because I'm actually shivering. Ooh. Ooh. It, it is actually that cold. It's two degrees. Two. This is a pretty fancy place. I was here once before. Well, me and my uh, date snuck, snuck in. It was like a concert and you have to, you have to pay money for the concert. And uh, they had the toilet, 
like past the security checkpoint. So we were like, can we go to the bathroom? And then we didn't know where the bathroom was, but they already let us in. And by that time we were like, oh, I guess we're in. <laughs> but it was a shit concert. It was like some rock band or, or whatever. I don't, uh, I don't listen to rock. I don't rock with it. Not the corona. It's an automated dumpster with uh, what is called a sun panel. Ooh. Well, I guess Pictures is open. Pictures is my pl favorite place because they have a. Uh, they're doing so much construction. Because it's like the only place you have like arcades in the basement. I always invite girls uh, down to the basement. <sighs> you know, Tinder dates and stuff. I'm like, you want to go down to the basement? To the basement of pictures? I think they might be remodeling, to be honest. Yeah, I think they're remodeling, maybe. But it does look like it's open. Lion Bar is super popular for students because they have like dirt cheap beer for like three, four dollars or something. Which typically beer costs like twelve dollars or something. There's a new shop, Dirty Tacos, not halal. Yeah, it's cold as fuck. My fingers are freezing. I got blisters on my fingers. <sighs> it's actually super cool. I like pictures a lot. It just sucks I, I, I can't stream there. Like, uh, there's no connection in the basement. That sucks. I managed to get a hold of their uh, Wi-Fi. <sighs> uh, but uh, even the Wi-Fi didn't really work, so I was like, fuck it. Fuck it then. They did install some lights for the castle. I did ask if they have lights for the castle. Oh, look. What are these called? Darts, I think. I don't think you can see anything. It's the water. If you fall down here, you're dead. You're dead, moose meat. Oh my god, it's so cold! And I'm not being a bitch either. Oh, stairway to heaven. There you go. You see that? When I blow my breath on the flash.
I got uh, three chicken burgers, one uh, uh, Yankee cheeseburger, which was a new one. It was new on the menu. And then I got uh, a Yankee cheese, uh, a Yankee chicken burger. That's what the name was. I didn't make the name up. They made it. Yeah, six cheeseburgers, uh, chicken burgers. You jealous? Oh, that's some nice effects. I tried to clean the camera, but it actually made it worse. But it looks better with the. Now it's like double crossed. It's like fat grease grease stains, vertical and horizontal. What did you get, Buster Rhymes? Oh. This is called an optical illusion. That's the sound, by the way. Beef stew. Nice. Was it slow cooked beef stew? Or nine? There was a case of a drunk kid in uh, Lynn Shopping, I think, uh, not far away from here, that fell down into a pond similar to this, like almost exactly like this, and then he drowned and died. So now the city has like, you know, they have these uh, spontaneous ladders everywhere, which is nice. They're pretty nicely designed. Like they're not, uh, what, what would you call it? They don't take up much eyesore, or they don't take up much space. Maybe if they made it wooden, it would have looked better, but whatever. They have one there, and then one there. I think it's like mandatory every 50 meters or something. I believe, no, that, that, I don't know. Is that 50 meters? It could be. Looks like it's 25 meters to us. Oh, I should have came with my Burger King here and sat down here. This is very cozy. You know, this is where they filmed Game of Thrones, right? And people actually live here. You know that? There's a family in, uh, in, uh, in my city. And I know, uh, the, I know one of them. I know the daughter. Oh, Wawa Weewa. Uh, they own two of the rooms in the castle. It's like a agreed upon thing because uh, this is kind of how it works because it's a historical event the government owns stuff that is like historically biblically accurate to the country but however even though it's a uh, you know a historical building and the government owns it they still can't completely steal it from the uh, like i guess the royalties or whatever that owned it back back then so they have like an agreement that uh the government owns the castle, but they get like a portion of it. So they own like 5% or something. Or like two, two rooms or something is, uh, you know, theirs. Oh, that's a, that, I think that's a moldy orange. And that's a nickel piga, nickel piga. That's a nickel piga. It's a ladybug. Oh. The, the rest of the rooms are uh, tourist uh, attraction and hotels. So it's not that expensive. I can book a hotel here. If, uh, if I remember correctly, it's like, uh, it's like 50, $60 a night for one room here. But I don't know, actually, if I would live. Nah, I don't think so. I mean, I would imagine that the, like, 
uh, the the building's not up to code in terms of like um, I don't know like regular isolation like noise cancellation uh, you know temperature and stuff it might not be up to code where it's comfortable you know and the structure the general what is it called the general structure what is it called the architecture the architecture is most definitely not up to par and I my I like myself some modern IKEA Swedish simplification architecture and this uh, it looks good looks like it's from Assassin's Creed but this is not it for me damn it's so big you can't even see it I have to zoom out unlucky well if I zoom out the colors get washed out boom yeah it's nice see that that's where the trolls live see that this is where I used to soup Soup is like the, I don't know if you know what soup is. Soup are those uh, rubber, highly pressurized boats, like a kayak basically, but with a standing one. It's called a soup, S-U-F. That's the uh, secondary center. We were at the center before, but there's two centers in the city. This one is called Jan Torjet. It's the secondary center right there. I don't know why I'm giving a historical, biblically accurate uh, lesson here, but uh, I don't know. I'm not a tour guide. And I need to go home because it's cold and my fingers are dying. Jesus. I think the most most people that live here are like politicians and more like higher up, I guess. This is a beaver dam. You know why they build something like this? You see it? You see how it's unnecessarily long and convoluted with crux and uh, bevels and stuff. See that? The reason why they build these are uh, so people ask questions and never get the real answer. I like this one. I want to go to a movie uh, in this one. This theater is a different type of theater. It's an old school retro theater. You know those old school 1920s uh, theaters? They play like old school movies, but they also play like uh, relevant concurrent movies. But it's like super, super old school. And the seats are like, uh, the rooms are super small, like the retro old ones, because only rich people could afford to go to theater back then and it's like uh, 12 to 16 seats in, in, in one room it's called the Roxy I think yeah I, that's I want to go there like I would a thousand million percent go there over a uh, normal cinema yeah the other cinema we have is like fancy and it's super big and they have a dedicated candy shop there or whatever but it's too much. Too much for me. Ugh. 